As part of its ongoing mission, the Parker Solar Probe flew close to the Sun for the 14th time. On Sunday, December 11th, at a distance of around 8.5 million kilometers, NASA's spacecraft flew by the Sun's surface, also known as the photosphere, in order to gather information on the corona, the outer atmosphere of the Sun. However, this flyby is not the closest approach for the spacecraft to the Sun. The spacecraft will get closer to the Sun during subsequent flybys, getting as close as 6,115,500 kilometers from our star's surface. The carbon composite shield on board the spacecraft is 11.43 centimeters thick and is designed to protect the spacecraft's scientific payload from the harsh space environment without sacrificing its ability to function normally. The main goal of the Parker Solar Probe is to study the Sun's outer atmosphere. In order to answer one of the most puzzling questions about the star, why is the corona so much hotter than the surface? Stellar physics theories predict that when one travels further into a star's plasma, both the pressure and temperature will rise. However, the corona disproves this common knowledge. The plasma in this layer, however tenuous and dispersed, is actually hotter than the plasma on the photosphere, the layer directly below the corona. While the photosphere, located just 1,600 kilometers below the corona, is 10 million times denser and reaches temperatures of only 10,000 Fahrenheit or 5,000 Celsius, the corona may reach temperatures of 1.1 million Celsius or higher. The photosphere blocks out light from the corona, so you can't see it from Earth until the moon completely blocks out the sun. This only occurs during a total solar eclipse. Using specialized equipment, scientists may get the same result. Because of the corona's role in generating the solar wind, a torrent of charged particles that may disrupt communication and power infrastructure on Earth, the Parker Solar Probe must get up close and personal with our star to better comprehend it. Since the Sun is the only nearby star accessible in this manner, researchers may use what they learn to better comprehend stars considerably distant from Earth. On March 17, 2023, the Parker Solar Probe will make its 15th close approach to the Sun, traveling around 8.5 million kilometers from the surface of the Sun. The spacecraft will make a swoop by Venus later this year to get into a more solar-aligned position as the mission's completion year of 2025 approaches. Let us know what you think in the comments section below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, check out our previous videos, and visit our website if you love reading at www.nasaspacenews.com Thanks for watching.